Hi everyone. This is uh, part six of the uh, series of the trip uh, to Gillette and on our way home. And this, uh, this portion was from uh, Salina, Utah and up to Jerome, uh, Idaho. Uh, this will be the last one uh, coming from uh, Jerome, Idaho to Richland was uh, straight uh, interstate and um, it, you know there was nothing there to really uh, video or anything like that so uh, basically we'll stop this um, headed up towards Jerome, Idaho. Um, it was a good trip the only thing was the issue with the um, uh, the oil issue and the regulator issue and uh, when I got to uh, when I got to Jerome, I went in there to the Harley dealership and talked to them. And uh, they had a different uh, motorcycle up on the uh, rack at the point at that time, and they said they could see me the next day. But at that point, you know, I was going to be home um, by the time they were going to be able to see it. So when I talked to him, he says, yeah, just go ahead and make sure that the oil is uh, taken care of. And uh, he's not going to guarantee that I would get home. But, um, you know, if I was going to do that, just, you know, make sure everything was up and, uh, uh, and uh, we'll see if I can get, get it home. Okay, looking at this map, we went from Salina over to 15, up 15. And then we came over to 80. Once we got to 80, then we went on 80 all the way over to Wells, Nevada. From Wells, Nevada, we went north on 93 until we got to Jerome. That was the end of uh, this day, and it was a total of... 455 miles. The next day we came on home and we came all the way up and uh, got into Richland and that was 461 miles. <laughs> Well, the issues that I had with the uh, regulator and the uh, and the transmission oil was taken care of when I got home 
and uh, under warranty those two items were taken care of and now the motorcycle is ready to go again so uh, I do appreciate everybody uh, watching and uh, I hope you've enjoyed it and uh, until the next time um, ride safe out there and uh, we will talk to you soon